you was concerned. How do you feel about it? Uh, I feel like I did great. You know, uh, I prepared well. Okay. I just came there and, and uh, just do what I do best. So for you, what was important to work on between the combine and now? And what are some of those other things you feel you got better at? Just getting in shape. And uh, I just had to show him I can move. The biggest question was, well, you want to see him move, you know, with their own eyes. And so I came in there. I came in here with my chip on, on my shoulder. I was ready to work. You think you helped yourself? Yeah. 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 I believe I did. You know, uh, just hearing from my team and everything, it just like my numbers and just, you know, coming here with my goal. You know, I, I cheat everything except for one thing, but uh, I'm very proud of myself. When you do these drills, I mean, how different are they than what you normally do? Because I'm sure you're not chasing a tennis ball every day. So how different are those drills compared to, I guess, what you normally do in practice or just on your own? I'll be honest with you, the, the bag stuff, stepping over, we did that in fourth quarter. The cone stuff, one around uh, figure eight and uh, bags, we do that with Coach Long. So that was bread and butter. You know, to be honest with you, I didn't really have to do so much work because I've been doing that for the last four years for the state. That exclamation that you yelled, you know, you guys wanted to see a show, here it is. Does that kind of have to do with going out and wanting to prove something to them? Oh, yeah, that, I was, man. You know, uh, I was just ready, you know what I'm saying? You know, when I finished off the the workout, I said sorry for the wait. Because this is what they was waiting on. They was waiting on me to uh, move. So, sorry for the wait. Uh, yeah, I think I'm Asian. I don't even, I don't even, I don't even know. To be honest with you. Any yeah, I have plenty. I just don't know. What's some common feedback that you've heard from teams throughout this process so they, far? Things they've wanted to see, things they've liked, that kind of stuff. My film is awesome. My numbers, no one's better. From D tackle DN, they just wanted me to come out here and, and prove it, show them to them. So I, that was my, you know, only thing. I had to come out here and pro and, and pro and show them. You mentioned having a chip on your shoulder. How do you keep that edge going when you're, you know, not competing, uh, like at a football game, and you right. keep that edge going? Man, it's just all, you know, it, it's just it's something I love. You know what I'm saying? And uh, you know, I just love just pushing myself and showing people, proving people wrong. That's my thing. So came out here and just did it. it seemed like the coach you were working with the Lions was a pretty intense guy. Is that something you, you like and did you know, or were you kind of caught off guard by that? No, I knew. Me and Matt, yes, sir. What's next for you? Where do you go from here? Where I go, bro. Uh, team workouts and just working out and uh, just smiling. You know, I'm very happy. I'm very happy right now. Mark, do you, do you have a preference where you play, inside or outside? And I play both. If teams express? Yeah, some of your teams, like, you know, I can play both. You know what I'm saying? You know, some teams to see me, you know, I can play a lot at three technique, and then sometimes the kids jump side, jump outside at five. Some teams seem to I, I can, I'm so versatile that, you know, I can, I can play both.